Okay, in this final segment, we want to take a little quiz about uh, volcanoes. So question number one, which one of the following is not a primary factor of magma that directly determines the nature of a volcanic eruption? Okay, so we mentioned that temperature does affect the magma, makes it either uh, runnier or uh, makes it uh, stickier. Okay, second one is amount of dissolved gases, yes, so that also can affect the amount of uh, stickiness that it has. Okay, the composition of the magma, yes, because we said that the amount of silica in it can affect the viscosity. So it's D. So the volume of the magma uh, does not determine the nature of the volcanic eruption. Now, it is going to determine the length of the volcanic eruption. So how long is it going to, to last? Mafic lava tends to be what? Tends to be runny. Volcanic ash is composed of what? Okay, be careful. So don't think about wood ash. So wood ash would be carbon but volcanic ash is composed of silica. Number four, a volcano that takes the shape of a broad domed structure is what kind of volcano? And that would be the shield volcano. It's shaped like a shield. And then what type of volcano produces the most vo uh, violent eruptions? Okay, that would be the stratovolcano and another name for that is the composite volcano. Number six, how fast are pyroclastic flows? And we said 200 meters per second, which is the closest to 100 meters per second. Number seven, uh, volcanoes uh, tend to make the climate what? Warmer? Yeah cooler? Yeah. So both of them, both A and B. Number eight, what is the most volcanic object in the solar system? That would be Io, the moon of Jupiter. All right, so that uh, finishes this up. So in our next lesson, we're going to learn about weathering, and then we will, after that, we'll talk about how the products of that weathering make sedimentary rocks. So I'll see you then.